The two young tackles, Wheeler and Dotson, and they'll shift left to right, as you can see here. Third and ten. Very big play for the Bears. Flag down. Dotson has the ball. Tampa football. Stripped by McCants. Harbaugh lost it to Dotson. Let's see what this flag is. There is no penalty on the play. There is no penalty. There is no penalty on the play. First down. All week, Sam Weiss told us we have got to get Mark McCants playing again. He says he practices hard. And here he comes right off the corner, gets to that arm. You're going to see him coming from the left side of your screen right there. Boom. See that? Ball's up. And there's Dotson. The guy always seems to be around the ball. Mark McCants, though. Keith. Number one pick. I'm sorry, Mark. I'm, losing. I'm thinking of Mark Wheeler. Keith McCants, the number one pick. Third down and five for the Bears. Coaching the end of the third quarter. It's an incomplete pass. And lucky it wasn't just a fumble. He Keith had the forward motion, or that could have been a turnover. Yeah, watch the bottom right side of your screen. You're going to watch Troy Ozine on Keith McCants. Now McCants gets to the top, throws a nice spin, catches him as his arm is just going forward. Looks to me like they've been waiting for Keith McCants to take a step up. Today, he's turned it up a notch. We got to get a surge if we're a Tampa Bay Buccaneers. We got to get some pressure. We've been giving them zone all the way down the field. We don't want to take chances. We want to let them make a mistake. Them being Chicago. And there he is, McCants. Fourth Buccaneers sack. Keith McCants has really turned it up today. They've been looking for somebody to take that step, and he's been the guy. Watch him come off the corner. He beats two people, the last one being Keith Van Horn for the sack. 